first today, Florida's governor gave the boot to Palm Beach County's election supervisor. Susan Booker today is out. She was the central figure in the recent troubles that plagued the county in the days after the midterm election. The now's Matt Sesney live for us at the elections office with more on the governor and reaction. Shannon, I can tell you that we're being told Susan Booker is planning to challenge this move by the governor and is actually talking with an attorney today. The news of this suspension seemed to happen suddenly today with word slowly leaking out late this morning. By this afternoon, by lunchtime, Governor Ron DeSantis was in downtown West Palm Beach making the announcement. He called the county inept during the recount process and compared Booker's leadership here to the Keystone Cops. Governor DeSantis says Palm Beach County did miss deadlines in those vote recounts, and those recounts stretched into December as tabulation machines here failed. So I think that there were a train of problems, and I think it was not just there was a mistake here, a mistake there. It really tarnished the image of the state of Florida, and I think unfairly. And so I want to make sure it doesn't happen again. All right, the governor has appointed West Palm Beach attorney Wendy Link to take over the supervisor of elections position. She will hold that position, DeSantis says, until or at least through the 2020 election. She just arrived here at the building, the headquarters here, just about 20 minutes ago. We're gonna have more on who she is coming up at five o'clock. And we're also at that time gonna hear from Democrats here in Palm Beach County who are outraged over this move and are calling it politically motivated. We're live in suburban West Palm Beach. Matt Sesney for the now, South Florida.